Hey friends, this is Mrs. Wolfie from our Half Acre Homestead and I am in Canadian Tire. And I've already started my preps for my dog. This is her and, oops, and batteries. So we're good to go. On to Costco. All right, we're done. I didn't get a whole huge amount of stuff, but I got stuff that counted. I got extra dog food. We got work. Our medicines are all covered. Like not our medicine, our over-the-counter medicines are all covered now. I got two kinds of cough syrup, two boxes of Mucinex. Um, I'll show you the other stuff when we get home and how he unloads it. But I scored. Okay, let's start with the Dollarama bag. I bought these just because I want to make Briar a cake. It's an inside joke in our family. This is the stuff I got at the dollar store. Um, stuff I actually kind of needed. These I seem to only be able to find at for the size for my island. Where the hell is it? Usually shows you a picture. There's the picture. The six to eight people, that's, I buy these for the island because you know me and tablecloths, right, folks? I kept my coffee in the fridge and that's the bagels for me. Oh, okay. So you, you, you took a coffee cream and a bagels out to the coach? And my hundred and some odd K cups. Oh, okay, good. All right. So those are in the thing. Now I got these. Because when I made those cheesecakes, these did really well. And I thought I'd make a couple of little two-person lasagnas and put them in the freezer. And here's my big... Well, I had to get a couple of little timers because I, I often have more than one canner running. Um, there's my hairpins, the big, big ones. You're seeing everything. The good, the bad, and the ugly. So there's my two timers. I got one green, one blue, uh, black, so that I can tell them apart which one's which. These are going in Briar's Christmas package. These are those. Um, these are those peelers that you know the the ones you I paid twenty three dollars for on Giant um, on Wish, and they didn't last a year. So, $3 at the dollar store, I'll go for it. And here's my big score. 15 boxes. Now, there were like 30, 35 boxes there, but I wanted to leave some for other people. I never thought that I should have bought them all and then just shared them, but I left some for other people. But I got 15 boxes. With that, with what Susan Bass sent me in large mouth ones, because I have a really hard time finding those, I have enough for the rest of the season. I'm all good. Thank you, God. So that was my dollar store haul. I went in looking for lids, and I came out with extras. This was a different Costco haul, okay? Um, got our milk, cream. Let's do the dairy products. 12 pounds of butter, my favorite. I think it's Natrell. Yes, it is. 12 pounds of butter. That was $51. Two bags of milk. Two bags of Parmesan cheese. A nice big brick of mozzarella that I think I will get out my KitchenAid thing and grate that up and then freeze it into bags. This is my brick of old cheddar and my brick of marble. I mean, I, I don't leave... Costco without buying some cheese. Here is our Kirkland Tylenol Muscle Relaxers. Um, please don't ask me to send you some of these in the mail. It would be illegal. And uh, But I wish I could because these are, I think it's $11.97 for two bottles. Howie's Christmas underwear. Grab all. This is for any nauseant. It's, um, you may call it Dramamine in the States. Benadryl, because Gracie has a way of breaking out. So that's all our over-the-counter meds with my two boxes of Mucinex and my cough syrups. I'm good for that, okay? There's my Christmas cards. Now, when I was getting these, I got one traditional 
and one peanuts because I got the peanuts cards last year and I really really loved having them so and these were a little expensive they were ten dollars for 30 cards hush crazy um, but I really really love them and so and when I was in the aisle and and getting these a, a man came along and said honey it's only August I said I don't want to be out in cold and flu season and he went brilliant so that's my christmas cards out of the way uh, my box of finish how he didn't pack these and he just there was no boxes uh, i already have another one of these on the shelf so i always like to pick up one um i don't like to be left without it there's the cream dairy uh head and shoulders I don't know what, I think it was $13 for the two of them. But you know what? I paid $8 for a bottle of shampoo at Giant Tiger. Here is some of my baking supplies I'm starting. Pumpkin seeds, pecans, dried apricots. Honestly, I just love to eat these, right? But you've got to be careful. They're kind of like prunes that way. My three-pack of Dawn, my nine loaves of bread. We got two bagels, but Howie took one out to the coach. Um... French's, French's, the most Canadian ketchup. Got two, two pack of those. Got my Hellman's, pepper, more maple syrup because our maple syrup went moldy because somebody didn't listen to me. Um, this is a really good deal, folks, for women. Now, you know, not every guy's going to do it, but remember, these work as bandages, too. These are, I, I used to buy a bag for $20 or $25 at the at the um, drugstore. This is four bags for $34.95. You can't beat it. My two bags of organic sugar. I like Scotch brand packing tape, and trust me, when I send out parcels, this is all I trust. And this is eight rolls for $12, and for that name, I will buy that. And here, are my triple a energizer batteries and my double a nomas only because i got these on sale i think i think honestly i probably paid 35 dollars for these two packs of batteries it doesn't look like much but when i do one more shopping or send howie on one more this was expensive these were 30 dollars but the thing is, is they're organic and they were the same price as the regular brand. So these are going in the fridge to be canned. We also bought um, pool algicide, two big bags of dog food because they were on sale for $45. And it's her brand that she, that's the only thing she can eat. So we bought two bags. And the next time he goes, he'll buy two more bags. And then we'll put it in a garbage pail with a lid on it to keep mice out and stuff. But then she's good for the winter, right? This is the Miss Wolfie from our half acre homestead saying by the time I'm done canning and I do one more shopping, my pantry's going to be chock-a-bock full and I will do a video uh, around mid-October showing you it all. All right. Mwah! Take care. God bless. <music>